Hi Mac fans, today we're going to have a look at a pretty common error that comes up in QGIS and that is the handle bad layers error. So I've got some prefabricated data here which I'm going to open up and it should throw us the handle bad errors or handle bad layers I should say error. There we go. So up it pops and it's asking us to handle our bad layers. Now the problem arises here because our original QGIS project file which is here the .qgs file only contains a reference to where our data is actually held and at the moment it's looking for shapefiles in this particular file path. Now on my file system this has actually changed so you'll often find this happens when you're sharing your QGIS projects with other people or if you rename folders and files then you might get a handle bad layers error and it's really easy to fix all you need to do if you know where your data is you just click on one of these so I'm going to go for global countries and then I'm going to go to browse and I will browse to where I know my data is held which is in here and I'm looking for globalcountries.shp that'll match up with this bit and we'll reset the path here um, the bit preceding the shapefile and then QGIS will know where to find it now there is quite a few different files um, in here and you can see for global countries we've got a DBF, a .prj, all of these if you want to make life a little easier you can put a filter on it and I'm just going to go with Esri shapefile and there we go. Now I can just see shapefiles and not all the other files that comprise a full shapefile. So if I click on global countries here and open that, excellent that's been fixed now we know where it is. I'm going to do the same for global land, marvellous and we'll do one for thistledown open that and then the last one is our nest sites and there okay so I've reset that you can see how the path changes and I'm gonna okay that and there's our layers very easy alright so that's all for this short video um, do get in touch via the comments if you've got any questions or queries don't forget to subscribe um, then you can keep up to date with all of the QGIS, ArcGIS, ArcGIS Pro hints and tips that are coming out and feel free to share the videos, always good. Happy mapping!